11 Alive is committed to making sure you always have the most up-to-date information about COVID-19, and that includes helping you sort through what can be complicated data about it. Jennifer Bellamy joins us now to give us some perspective on the latest numbers. Jennifer, walk us through the trends that we're seeing. Sure, we're taking a look at three things tonight. So let's start with new cases first. We want to focus on those because we're watching Georgia's average tick up. Over the past seven days, that's the section that you're going to see here in orange on this graph. We have seen a spike. There are a couple of reasons, though, for this. More people are getting tested, plus people are starting to become more mobile and interacting with one another more. Experts tell us those factors help explain the reason we're seeing more cases right now. So let's move on to the number of people who are in the hospital right now. This information is the closest that we have to real time. These are the most severe cases, the ones that require serious medical attention. We continue to see this number go down from 1500 at the beginning of the month to 848 today. It seems like this drop is starting though to slow down a bit here. And as far as deaths are concerned, we saw a big jump late last week, but only three deaths were reported on Saturday and 16 Sunday. Now there may be a good reason for that. It's a holiday weekend and reporting typically slows down on the weekends. Nearly every drop that you see on this graph marks a weekend. So what we'll really be telling is what we see after Memorial day is over and reporting picks back up again. Those numbers will be a better indication of what's going on. And as always, if you have a question about the data or the numbers, let us know and we'll work on getting you some answers. It is good perspective, Jennifer. Thank you. And always good that patience is required because the state says it takes at least two weeks before we really know the result of, you know, let's say a busy Memorial Day weekend. Thanks a lot.